we were performing and like someone in the crowd like held up he like was on his phone he held it's like a crappy little Nokia kind of thing and held it up and I looked at it and it said like I think you're shit <laughs> I know I know it's just like come on you didn't need to do that <laughs> like I mean some people would still doubt my talent you know what I mean I don't think you ever like you can't ever just think that you're, you know, you're talented. Um, but yeah, plenty of times. I said to my parents, I was like, I'm going to go and get a job. I'm going to move to Brighton, like a city. And I'm, gonna, I'm not going to have a gap year. I'm going to go and do like a job <laughs> for my gap year. And when I become a successful musician, that's when I will travel. <laughs> like, that's when I'll see the world. And I got a job in like a kitchen washing dishes in a, like a pizza shop and yeah just worked in a kitchen it was very boring <laughs> but i used all that time to like make like make demo cds and give them out and try and meet people and, and yeah like on a sunday night it was like crazy cold winter whatever in brighton like going to this club night I think probably what I did is on the way out, I said to the guy on the door, I was like, oh, like, I make music, by the way. Like, I don't know if you want, like, a DJ, and gave him a CD. And then I think I probably came back the following week and then had, like, some... I'd made some uh, progress, I don't know. But, yeah, it's terrifying, making friends. You basically, from the moment you want to do it, you start having to make decisions, like, you have to start shutting down like other things on and like focusing on on the thing